I wanted to give you a brief update of how I've been, what I've been doing, challenges, etc. Uh, today I'm up in, uh, well, past Bingen, Washington, at Coyote Wall. I think it might be technically called Syncline, but yeah, I mean, the trailhead says Coyote Wall, everything says Coyote Wall. So, anyway. Uh, yeah, kind of quick update on me. Uh, have an opportunity to try to do a little bit more mountain biking and being outside, but uh, had a couple issues. One of them, uh, right after Thanksgiving, uh, my company uh, told me my position was being eliminated. It was the third downsizing in 12 months. It was uh, not a complete shocker, but obviously it hurt. It hurt real bad. Uh, I was with that company for 15 years. Had a lot of good friends, teammates, coworkers. Oh, it was just, it was great. But, you know, Keen had some issues. I had uh, 12 bosses in uh, 15 years. It makes it hard to, you know, really build up relationships with leadership and etc. And, and I made a lot of mistakes. I wish I could go back and redo. But it is what it is. And I've been uh, looking for a job. Uh, oh, where do I go now? Well, I'm going to go back to the way I came. But, uh, uh, so yeah, job hunting. And then I think about three weeks ago, maybe a little bit less, uh, had uh, discovered a growth that I didn't really like. Went to the doctor. He didn't like it. Uh, and for those of you who don't know, I had cancer about 11 years ago to the day. Um, and uh, really freaked me out, freaked my wife out. Uh, you know, obviously we thought the worst because it started the exact same way last time. And uh, where something didn't look right and go see specialists, go see specialists, you know, get things taken care of, you know, blah, blah, blah. Well, fast forward to just a few days ago. Uh, it's not cancer. <laughs> well, evidently my GoPro didn't like uh, cancer. Anyway, uh, it is not cancer. Um, had a minor procedure surgery, I guess technically, and got that uh, taken care of, and hopefully it should be good for a while. Uh, but definitely uh, shook me to my core. So on the top of being unemployed, for the first time since I was 16 years old. Uh, and a health scare it makes me realize that I need to get out and do the stuff I love while I can. Time is incredibly limited and something can happen like a ton of bricks. Um, so yeah, no regrets, get out there, etc. So now my body's basically healed. I can uh, get out here and ride again. Feels so good. I love this place. Hard climbing, but man, the trails, the scenery is just the best I have ever seen. I mean, I rank it up there with, you know, places in Moab and etc. So, highly recommend it if you've never been out here. Um, be careful if you get poison oak, because I got poison oak out here a couple of times. So, all right, well, that's my update. Uh, and hopefully I can uh, have fun coming down. On the way out, my wife said, be careful, which she rarely does. But since it is Valentine's Day and, you know, we want to go out and have some fun tonight, have some dinner. I assume she doesn't want me to get hurt. So I'm staying off the coyote wall side where it's really rocky and I'm all alone. So I'm going to do this Malware stuff. And, uh... Try not to get hurt. Man, I love this section. The trees, the trail is perfect. Mud's flying up in my face. Guess I gotta check the camera once in a while, make sure it's staying clean.
Oh, right in my eye. Advantage about being off the bike for a few weeks is I can, my knee can my knee can heal up, ankle, other things. So been doing uh, lots of walks with my wife, and it's been a real treat to do that with her. So but yeah, so my body feels good though, incredibly weak, out of shape. So I need to get back and doing my core exercises so my back doesn't get injured knees and ankles can stay strong in my upper body used to this impact oh and everything works out planning on going on a mountain bike trip I'm gonna go to Bentonville Arkansas so it's part of a gift I got from Keen reaching my 15 years haven't used it yet it's still uh, usable and uh, so I need to do it while I can. And part of the deal is I'm renting a bike and uh, just kind of out of a surprise it ends up being an e-bike. So I'm not going to complain. All right, little Moab, here we go. So it'll be my first time on an e-mountain bike. That should be uh, enjoyable, entertaining. If I don't like it, I assume I can just go back and get an acoustic bike Ugh. like a river goodness oh my gosh I don't remember that on oh probably because I took that different trail Okay, well now I'm wet. Man, this is so beautiful. Try not to skid. I got a duck. Oh, brakes are heating up. Make a it's the way my bike's telling me I put on a few pounds. <laughs> a lot of these turns have like really nice berms going into them, but then there's like off camber on the exit. So you really gotta be careful. That was a terrible line. Uphill. Well, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but down there next to the cliffside, there's a tree. And there's a bald eagle in it. I'm pretty sure with my settings, I'm not going to be able to see it, but I saw two golden eagles on the way up two other bald eagles and now this one actually I think there's two in there 
Maybe I gotta change my settings. Oh no, I can't reach my... I don't want to undo my angle and everything. Anyway. Really cool. Alright, I'm on a little Maui. I think I might have called it a little Moab last time. I apologize. Moab's the really rocky one on the cliff face at Coyote Wall. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to do a little Maui again. My hands have locked up. So I can't feel very much. So this is not going to be as fast or as playful. So just trying to make it down and have a good time. Let's do this. Sorry for the skid. I did it again, shoot. So fun. Really working on bike and body separation. And get the bike leaned over more in the corners. Ah, still a terrible line. Yeah. Look at that view. Does it really get better than this? I don't know. I guess maybe shuttling, but I like pedaling. Maybe if they had a paved road climb, <laughs> it'd be a little bit better, but uh, just the climb is amazing as well. Hotline! Oh, danger. Oh. That is my uh, little trip to Coyote Wall. Love it. 
say goodbye, Oregon. <laughs> Man, I just really love it out here. It's about an hour, hour, 15 minute drive for me, but uh, yeah, definitely worth it. I need to do it more often. Oh, that looks like almost like a jump. Yeah. All right, well, thanks for listening. And uh, if you have any questions about my health stash or anything like that, you can let me know. I try to be delicate and answer if you're really, really curious. Um, otherwise, get out there and ride. Time is limited. Don't look back and say, I regret not doing X. Get out there and try it. Have fun and God bless.